Medicaid is about kids and moms for the most for the most part. Hospital Administrator Christopher Jett says hundreds of patients who receive treatment at USA Children's and Women's Hospital come from across the state line in Mississippi. For those on United's Medicaid plan, that will no longer be an option come the new year. United is dropping Alabama hospitals from its coverage plans. For those who need to see specialists, that will mean a two and a half hour drive up to Jackson. Many patients are receiving treatment once or twice a week if, they're, if the disease process requires that. So that is going to require them to travel to Jackson for that once or twice a week. United Healthcare says if a Medicaid patient is already undergoing treatment in Alabama when the change goes into effect, they can continue receiving covered services through their continuity of care program. But any new patient will not be covered for treatment at an Alabama hospital. Jet says the change will also impact those who find themselves in an emergency. For example, if a United Medicaid patient is flown to Mobile from Mississippi, they won't be covered. Those patients will be required to pay those bills out of pocket, um, and none of us would be able to do that, and, and these are some of the most vulnerable patients. Jet says while there are three Medicaid providers in Mississippi, United covers about the majority of those people. Those on Medicaid do have the option to switch to one of the other providers if they want to be covered for treatment at Alabama hospitals. USA Health officials say they are actively trying to work with United to come up with a solution. In Mobile, Katarina Luktich, WKRG News 5.